Hi, I'm Jenny with Simply Beautiful Crafts on behalf of Expert Village. Today we're going to make a country Christmas wreath. This is my country Christmas wreath. You can find many different kinds of Christmas ribbon in the stores. I like to use one that's actual cloth as opposed to the satin ribbon because to me it gives it a little bit more of a country look. So I chose this ribbon for my country wreath. You want to begin by weaving your ribbon through your wreath. You want to cover the joints so you start anywhere on the wreath, doesn't matter, and weave it through covering your joints. What I like to do beforehand is to measure my wreath with my ribbon. If you go all the way around your wreath and then about a quarter of a way around again, you should have enough ribbon to go all the way around your wreath. Or you can simply leave it in your spool and weave it through. When you get all the way around, you're going to want to use your glue gun to secure your ribbon so that it doesn't fray. And that you can do if you cut off the end so that it's nice and straight. Then use a little bit of glue right here in the joint and secure your ribbon carefully into that joint. Then when you get around, with the end of the ribbon again, you'll simply secure that piece over this piece. Once you have your wreath completely wrapped in your ribbon, it's time to embellish your wreath. There are many different things that you can find in the store. I went to a scrapbooking aisle and I found these little, I call them doodads, little buttons. Actually, they were in the button section that kind of looked country. And I found the little balls, a huge bag of them, and I can use them for country Christmas, Victorian Christmas, traditional Christmas. Once you have found what you want, first of all, place them around your wreath without gluing them. That gives you an idea of how it looks. You can play with it and get the balance that you like. Once you've done that, you can go ahead and use, again, your glue gun. Put glue on the back of your button or your ornament or your scrapbooking sticker and put that in where you want it. The last thing you want to do when you're finished with your wreath, once it's all nice and dry, is to secure some kind of a hanger. I used gold braid. You can use some of your ribbon or you can use wire. Once it's all dry, your country Christmas wreath is finished and ready to hang on your tree. Merry country Christmas.